What is going on everybody? Welcome to a brand new first look and review of a SLR mod pack. It's been a it's been a hot minute since the last time I did a review of a mod pack, but I've got two for you in December. So expect one uh, a little bit later this week or next week. I'm not too sure. Welcome to this one. This is Street Legal Racing Redline Peak Angle made by Keyboard Smashing as an art. Uh, he old school viewer, you know, lo lo lots of uh, lots of talks with him. Uh, respect, respect my guy. I love when uh, you guys make you guys make mod packs and send them to me. I've got another one by a viewer, so you know that's that's pretty cool. So first things first, uh, I want you guys to know that the icon for the game is not that stupid yellow car, <laughs> but is uh, Takumi Fujiwara's father, uh, Bunta Fujiwara. I'm pretty sure. Um, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> that's pretty cool. The fucking the icon for the game is different. Also, I don't know how much you can see of the background, but this is very JDM, very very JDM. Um, because I've locked the frames to thirty right now, everything is going very very slow. But in a second now, you will see what's uh, so special about this. Does that not look like a perfect place to park an A eighty six or maybe a Subaru Impreza two two B? That's right, boys. We're um, we're at the tofu shop. We're at the tofu fucking shop. Look at him. He goes up his fucking ladder up to his house or some shit, dude. Maybe he doesn't have fucking stairs or something. I don't know. I don't know. But um, this is a work in progress, not a complete. You know, this is still a whip. It's not a complete clean mod pack. Uh, you know, so don't expect everything to be perfect, but it should be good. Let's see what uh, this. What, let's see what this has to offer. There's nothing in that career, so let's check out what kind of faces we got. Alright, it's the stock boys. There's a lot of them, but it's just the stock boys. I was expecting some filthy anime shit, bros. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. <laughs> so, the garage. I really like the garage. This is... I'm pretty... Where am I? I'm pretty sure this is... Um, like, I, I think this is from... Uh, what game? The GTA 5 garage, maybe? I don't know. But it looks cool. It looks cool. It's like funky and shit. So let's um, let's check out what kind of car list we've got, because that's uh, very important, of course. Sprinters. So I think this is pretty pretty much very drift focus. So uh, you know there'll be a lot of um a lot of drift mainly focused cars. We got an E9. I was like, what the fuck is an E9? 11 BMW Corolla. What is a Corolla 77? Ah, all right. This is Firo. We got a Crested JZX100, I mean, allegedly, we have a Crested JZX100, so Crested, alright, Datsun 510 Sport, interesting cars, 240, Drift Machine, spelled wrong, Drift Machine, I don't know, oh, it's got a little fucking screen on it, oh, okay, okay, yo, let's see, Drift Competition 2 JZ, alright, alright, it's actually pretty clean, pretty clean, Rocket Bunny, no, thank you. We got a 5.6, a Evo 6. Oh, look at this fucking beauty. Look at this fucking beauty. Oh my, it's got even proper, like, fucking little snippets about the cars here. We got JZX90, Mark II Grandy. Yeah, it's a Mark II. I don't know what I expected. Pretty cool, I really like JZXs. A Key 70 Coupe. What is this? That is, uh, that is when the fuel was very... This car is from when the fuel, there was a fuel crisis, it's obvious. <laughs> 180 is X from 89. So we got a uh, 2000, 1994 and a 1989, so a Kuke and a Zenki. Pretty cool, although, the, although those are the facelift tail lights, it doesn't matter. Uh, Sylvia's S15, S13, Opel Manta, yeah, a GTS 25T. GTS 25, that's a long ass name for... Uh, what are those wheels, boss? What are they? Where is the door? What is the car doesn't have a door, boss? Uh, GTS RX7 GSL SSE. What are these fucking cars? All right, this is an FC. An FC. Yeah, it's got a rotary. I can see that from uh, the see-through panels of the car. Uh, see on FRS S14 S13 RX8 Impreza 22B. I like that. I like the 22B. Oh man, such a beautiful car. Hello, Bunta Fujiwara. R34. Oh, the car even started. Choose between 15 models. 
BNR32, HCR34, so four door and two door GTR, 240S, another 240? How many fucking 240s do we have in this game? All of the 240s. Toyota Hilux. All right, you got me there. That's not a two. That's that's not a Toyota boss. We got a nice clean super. Honestly, this is a high model of a super. I think this is a better model than my current Let's Play uh, Supra. And we got a Mark II JX70. So the car list is very JDM. I like this thing. This looks nice. I love the red interior. I love the red interior. So we got a, a lot of cars. A lot of um, mainly, I mean, 50 cars. That's not too much, but uh, work in progress. And I do like how these cars look. Um, look, they, they, I think they have solid models. So let's buy a car. The model is pretty good. I just realized that I've been recording in 720p this whole time. So uh, I'm sorry about that, guys. Uh, at least it's 60 FPS. I'm, I'm very sorry that I'm recording in 720 FPS, uh, 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 720p. Because the models are actually pretty fucking mint. This thing is clean AF dude so let's start looking around things so um oh yeah the car started that's pretty cool that's a pretty cool script where the car starts and shit so I think uh, most of these have drift monies drift money drift monies AC showroom Akagi Toge Akina Hill pro hopefully the good Ak Akina Hill from SA there are a few versions in SA one is very accurate and good Bathurst nice Benny's Garage, cool. Oh, Brands Hatch. But a Drift Brands Hatch? What the fuck is a Brands Hatch? This looks like it's a normal Brands Hatch, but it has Drift Points, probably. CC Warehouse. Ebisu Minami. Fujiwara Tofu Shop. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> golden Port. What is a Golden Port? I don't know. High Speed Mobi. What are these? Nevada? Yeah, yeah. Tokyo Drift... Odaiba D1. Oh my god, dude. Shinjuku. Oval. Test. Tra trash track. Valo City. Yeah. Alright. Alright. This has... This has... Oh, 20 maps. That's a good amount of fucking maps. Plus... It has, like, some... Interesting looking maps that we... I've never really seen before. And I've made a bunch of reviews... Uh, of SLRR mod packs. So, um... That's actually pretty exciting. Let's see... Let's see the engine list. Uh, that's also very important in such a game. It's very important to have a bunch of fucking engines. So you got 2JZ HKS, 2JZ Greddy, BC Stroker, Jun Stroker, complete engine for 11,000, GE, 4A GE. Okay, we got 72 UZ on BB93 is 2J, so we got all of the 2Js we want. 1 UZFE. Two UZFE SR20s, all the SR20s one would want. Hopefully these are good. Unlike my drift SR20 and my um my car RB26 single turbo. Oh, I like this. I've not seen this before. S85 B50. God bless, man. That's my favorite engine, give or take, obviously. But you know, V8 whole full G63 Mitsubishi. I like that. I like that we have that. Even though I don't think we have Mitsubishi. Oh no, we have one Mitsubishi. I'm sorry. Evo 6 versus 2-2-B. 13-B, V8, fucking 13-B, stage 3, stage 4. Okay, we got a lot of stages here. Oh my god, 6 liter, 5.3, 4.8, 6.2. Yes, yes, give me the LS, even though I've never really... L28, there's an L28, alright. For cylinder 3 liter, complete motor. This looks very German. K24, yeah. We got a solid amount of fucking engines, boys. I like this. I like this. Devils, yeah. I like the idea of these engines. You know, Audi RS 4.232 Val. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. But it's the Devil V V8 V6, so it's not really an actual engine. So I'm pretty sad about that. So we got STI engines. Okay. I like the engines. I like the engines. What about like shady things like decals? Okay. No decals, but decals are a bit unstable. Plus, decals are only good looking at the looking in them uh, in, in the menu. They're never good. They're never actually good. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, that, that's uh, that's important a note. So, um, we're gonna give the car a nice little modification, and uh, we're gonna go test it out on the street. 
Um, as you can see, the Subaru has changed a bit. It's no longer a Subaru. It's one of those drift machine uh, cars, but I removed the ugly ass over fenders, the absolutely disgusting roof scoop, and a uh, stupid wing. Now the car is much cleaner. Um, also, I've noticed that it has fog lamps. It has fog, fucking fog lamps. Uh, that's ridiculous. I did not expect to have it to have fog lamps, but everything about the models is absolutely crisp and clean. Everything you click on things and it just fucking well. Oh, this is part of the chassis, alright, my bad. I was about to say, it, that was about to break my point, but you click on things, they just remove. Look at that, oh my, so smooth. Plus, everything is nice and small in here. You don't need to scroll 50 times through these things, man. Nobody wants to do that. Um, I like that. Everything just feels smooth in this game. Everything just feels smooth and clicky, which I very like. Also, um, this car has no good suspension, even though it's a drift car. Even though uh, this is a mostly... I think the whole idea for this mod pack is drifting, but um, uh, but uh, uh, keyboard smashing is not. Also said that night races are working perfectly, so you know you, uh, we've got all the possibilities in this one. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the suspension because I forgot to show you guys. So as you can see, you might be like, "Oh shit, no real suspension." Nah, boss. Nah, boss. Everything's on the other end this time. Mr. Sir's KWs, V stands, everything is here. Same with the shock absorbers. You might be thinking, "Oh no, fakeness." Low polygon fakeness, nah, boss. Look at this, it's got everything. It's got everything you would uh, want. You just got sway bars. I don't know if you can put them on cars. You got no kids, others. Oh, I should not have clicked that. I don't even know what the fuck that is. All right, well, oh, Vox. We found Vox. Drift kit, pneumatic shock absorber, plus more of these things. What? What is this? I've stumbled upon something. That's fine. Are those lug nuts? That's pretty cool. Um, we got rims, but the game crashed last time when I went into the rim, so, I don't know. <laughs> we got a lot of options, uh, I'm pretty sure. Rims, uh, well, the best thing is, you got rims, 15 to 22, you go into tires, 15 to 22. So everything is just neat, nice and clean, you just choose one, and you go buy the other one, you don't need to fucking look, and look at the numbers, and look at the shit, you just do what you gotta do. Uh, so everything is very clean in this, and I very much enjoy it. I very much respect that. What is this? Skylines. Skylines drift. Get the fuck out of here. So, since this is a drift game, let's go uh, and see how well this thing drifts. <laughs> I'm very confused. This is auto, and it's shifting in 4K. That's nice. That, I mean, economic. You know, it's it's eco. I mean, eco friendly. Not eco friendly, but you know, you're driving on that eco shit. Game. Thank you. It's not manual plus auto clutch. That's exactly what we need. This has a red line of 5k. Can you hear the audio? It's literally breaking my fucking. Oh my god, what the fuck, dude? Oh, shit. Right, since the audio is just banging and destroying my uh, my headphones, probably destroying yours uh, as well, um, I'm gonna turn that off. Yeah, because you can see you got drift points. Oh, these things are not on display. This, these, this is not an accurate brand sketch. If they put these things here in real life, oh, that'd be, that'd be tragic. Because some fuck shit would happen, because you miss that turn very frequently. All right. Let's not slide down. I love that this car is uh, red line is at 5,000 RPM. That's the normal red line for a 2JZ, right? Also, this drifts like a very stock BMW 320D, even. Not even an... Oh, oh my god. I mean, it doesn't drift, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, it's fucking wobbly as shit. To be fair, it's got fake new suspension, 5,000 RPM. That's so fake. Why are there so many things on it? Oh shit, is this from... Is this from, uh, fucking the game? Yeah, speed hunt. Uh, Pro Street, is this from Pro Street? I have a feeling that this is from Pro Street. I'm pretty sure this is from Pro Street. No actual game would put these things, man. No, that's ridiculous. Are these, I don't know. Can you hit these things? Let's get... Okay. Well, I lost... I oh, made some money, I guess. But, yeah, I, I, this car needs a lot of tweaking. I don't think... I don't think... That, you know, that doesn't mean anything for the 
um, game itself for the mod pack itself. But what I'm what I've seen is uh, this is a very solid mod pack. And uh, if you guys are interested in uh, playing this, a link in the description. One JZ 1.5 with the idol. Of... All right, boys. <laughs> All right, boys. What kind of power are we making now, boys? What is this? What's gonna happen now? Is this engine gonna blow up? What are you gonna do now? Oh, look at this thing. Nobody, any, everybody. Twelve thousand or okay, right. This is not. This is no longer a first look and review, but I'm gonna go and have some fun with this thing. <laughs> we have found ourselves in GTA San Andreas. By that I mean we have found ourselves uh, in the Mount you know. <laughs> is that the fucking tofu shop? The car is not starting. That's a nice. Oh my god. Right, well, it's a bit hard. Is this the tofu shop? Yep, that's the, this is the tofu shop, but by the looks of things. Alright, so this is this is the shitty Akina. This is not the good Akina. Let's see how this car performs now with its 12,000 horsepower. Oh my god, that was loud, boss. That was fucking loud. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> this fucking. Dude, this is. I've tuned this like a god, dude. Let's see. Look at the RPM 2000, 3000, 4000. Oh! <laughs> I've tuned this car to perfection, boys. Well, uh, this is going to do it for today's review. Hope you guys like this. This is a solid mod pack. Uh, thanks for uh, Keeper Smashing as an art for sending this in. And um, I hope I did it justice because uh, this is actually pretty solid mod pack. Pretty solid stuff. Thank you for watching. Link in the description before somebody fucking asks. If, although this is the end of the video. 99% of people will not be here. So if you're here... Uh, Shout out to you, um, you know, show yourself in the comments if you've made it to this point, that's pretty legitimate, but thank you for watching and I shall see you in the next one.